Hey guys, John here, and welcome back to The Walking Dead. Alright, so I re-uploaded those previous videos and those five long installments, and we're pretty much where we should be. What we'll be missing is one conversation, and that was the conversation that Lee and Lily had in which he told her about the stuff that was missing or whatever, and they talked about who it might be that was doing it, and that a mystery needed to be solved. And that's pretty much all we missed. Uh, so we're going to start this chapter three right here. And, uh, yeah. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. <laughs> um, fine. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird i'm on the case i think it's easier just to let him do it at this point hmm. all right oh can we go over here we can't that's lily's door all right so i gotta get back in the swing of things here i haven't played this in forever like two years so there's that um I guess I could show this to her and see if she knows anything about it. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? <laughs> no. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> oh, I love Clementine. She's adorable. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. <laughs> Poor Clem. Um, okay. So I could go upstairs. What's over here? Oh, I could ask them about the flashlight, I suppose. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry uh -oh. guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Uh, let's ask him about the Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant mm. to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Hmm. About the guns. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. Um, you guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. Okay, well, I'm not going to tell him to try harder with Lily. I'll talk I mean, to you later. Lily's almost impossible to get along with. Um, okay, the ice machine is back this way, I believe. Camera. Help me out here, camera. Um, oh, keep going. 
Keep going. There we go. There's some broken glass on the ground there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That fits. Oh. Why is there an X? Doc. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Yeah, boy. Hmm. I can't look at that. I guess I could ask them about the pink chalk. Seems the more likely one to know. Though on the way, I suppose I should ask him about if he's seen the egg. Have you seen any chalk around? Ah, uh, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, of course. I'll talk to her. That was kind of obvious. Hope you might have a thought about why there might be an extra one over there, but... Oh, Carly. Let's go have a chat with Carly. Carly's nice. Talk to Lily yet? Yeah, she thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Oh. Think about you too. Sure. <laughs> Our group is small. You're small. <laughs> You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. Wow. I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Totally right. right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I'll let people know. You're totally right. People Good. that I trust. I think it's for the best. Hey now. Don't call me small. <laughs> now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Um... Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. Okay. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Those questions were kind of useless. She's just gonna say she saw Clementine with chalk and then the other question is just gonna be basically you should do it, so. Um... I'll ask her about the chalk. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. No, 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 I wanted to keep talking. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues. Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. Fine. Cool. Duck thinks you're incredibly awesome. <laughs> That's great. But I'm not I'm not ready to uh... I wanna see if I can tell Clem about my past. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie.
Before I met you and before the plague, I killed somebody. Oh, so that's what... Yeah, that's it. It was a bad thing and there's no explaining it. Why are you telling me? Because I didn't want to keep it to myself anymore. Do you have any questions? You can go on back to your things. Let me try to understand. Good. All right. Next, we got to talk to Kenny and Katya here about it. Hi, guys. But Oh, I had to choose. Okay. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What do you got? Scott, it's not going to be easy, but it's got to be done, it's and serious. I do trust Kenny. Oh, no. What'd the she-devil do to you? Shut up, man. I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's. Different from everything. This was before the walkers. Uh... I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and, you know, I, I was worried. I just smashed a guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. <laughs> you saw me do that, right? Yeah, I did. <laughs> And you're talking about who we were? The fuck does that matter? It's everything this mess has got us doing now, Lee. Shit. Look, is Duck safe around you? Of course. Then shut it. You don't owe anybody any kind of explanation. Cool. Kenny appreciates your honesty. Should I tell Katya then? I mean, I have a feeling like he's going to tell her, right? I mean, he would, right? Yeah. Mm. I don't know. I don't think I need to, per se. I think what he said pretty much summed it up. I don't think we have to worry about that anymore. So, let's look at this. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we need to look at this, then. Hmm. Somebody was over here, too. See? I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck. You did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Ooh, all right. Take a look outside. Mm. Those bandits gave us hell, but they've been quiet for days now. Yeah. Look over this way, maybe? No? Okay. Nothing there. Walk further down. Oh. This. <clears throat> oh, get it. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Y'all got our people out there! Out we ain't fucking around! What do oh, we do? Boy. Oh, Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily. What the hell are you? Stall them. What? Just keep them talking. 
do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest oh. mistake of your life. Could give me that sniper rifle. Enough of this bullshit. Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors. Yeah. Hold it, asshole. Take it easy. Uh. We have more supplies. We can keep the deal going. Too late, shithead. We ain't giving second chances. It, it was a mix-up. We'll make it worth your while. I'm listening. Uh. We'll leave you everything. Just let us walk out of here. So you can try to pay us a little visit later? Fuck that! Alright! I've had enough of this shit! Drew! Take these motherfuckers! Christ! Oh gosh. Oh, shit. Uh oh. No. That sucks. Smoke him out. We gotta get out of here. No shit. Get those bastards. Cover our people and get them to the RV. Oh lord. Oh, I got him. Ah, yeah. Get over here. Go, 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 go. Let's go. Oh, no. Gotcha. Hang on. Wow. Oh, got them both. Got him. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Get inside the RV. It's gonna be okay. Go. Oh no, 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 no. Oh Christ. Oh God. Oh Lord. Lily, get in the RV. Screw her. Let her stay. Wow. After all she just did for us. so much you can do girl okay Cat, Jesus are you okay I'm fine I'm fine oh shit oh shit oh shit I'm sorry everything's fine everything's ben. not fine we need to figure out how this happened we just lost everything well we're lucky as shit to have this RV and nobody died cat's head is split I'm open I'm fine somebody in here caused this Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Carly, is there something you want to say? Carly? Please, we have to get it out of you then. Back off. You are in no position to make demands. Whoa, 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 Carly. you're just pointing fingers. Carly's trustworthy. She's not a traitor, Lily. Thank you, Lee. She can fight her own battles. Unless there's something going on here that implicates you both. Don't right. be ridiculous. I would bring her the proof. Look, maybe we should vote or something like that. Vote? What? Just look. Carly's a stand-up gal and maybe this was all just a mistake. We need to look at the facts. Let's calm down, we'll eat, and we'll deal with it. Guys, we have to act now. I know it sounds nuts, but we have a traitor here. Do you guys get that? I'm thinking, Someone who ben. puts their insidious shit above everyone else. Thank you, Lee. Nobody was stealing anything. Was it both of you? What? I've seen you two together. 
Was it both of you? Look, it's not just let Carly. me out. I didn't do it, but I don't like this. I don't like where it's headed. Look me in it's the totally eyes been. and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. Lily, lay off of him. I... Holy What's crap. going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. All right, well, we can deal with this now, then. Kitty, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily. Out. I had to pause there for a second, sorry. <laughs> Need a drink. Oh, is that thing still alive? Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. I'm not going to take this. You can push Ben around, but you can't push me around. There's no way it was Carly. It was somebody else. It could have even been someone sneaking into our camp. That's ridiculous. That's what you think? Yes. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to He's trust me? It, I'll do anything. It's totally I'll, him. I'll do watches for a month. Huh, the hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. You're making it worse on yourself. I just don't want to be on my own. You should have thought of that. Do we need any more evidence than this? Fuck evidence. Stop treating him like this. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Kenny, what's it going to be? Just give me a damn minute. Then you have until that walker is dealt with to tell me it was her and not you. Stop this. You're torturing him. No. Ben, stop. This is about trust, and I've never trusted you. All right, just calm down. Lay off. I can't leave. You know I can't. Thank you, Lee. Please, listen to him. Please don't kick me out of the group. I mean, I'm for well, kicking him me. out. No, I'm for kicking now. Ben out, but not Carl. There. I got him. Please, let's just get back That's in the That's not RV. happening. You think you're some tough bitch, don't you? Like nothing can hurt you. But you're just a scared little girl. Get the fuck over it. Take a page from Lee's book and try helping somebody for once. Now. What the fuck's the problem? Drop it. What? Holy fuck. Kenny, what's happening? Keep duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. She couldn't be trusted, Lee. I swear. Please. You're not coming with us. I'll die out here. I don't care. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. I don't care what he did before. You know? Yeah, he told me. I don't give a shit. If we keep you with us, how long until you get me? I was trying to protect all of us. I don't have anything left. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. Wow. I'm still convinced it was freaking Ben, too, is the problem. Oh. Did you get you psycho? I oh my gosh, Carly! No, ah, oh, it sucks. Lee, a word, please. Um, you okay? in a second. Katya needs you for something. What's up? Is Duck feeling all right? Uh, 
Oh what no. The fuck. Happened during the raid. What's the plan? We've never had a bite victim in the group before. I'm going to keep an eye on him and see what I can do from a medical perspective. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Important to stay honest with each other. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. Holy crap. Holy freaking crap. Boy, oh my gosh, this is a nightmare, all of this. Duck is bit. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What about Carly? There was no time for a burial. Walkers? Yeah. Horrible. Me too. I heard you outside my treehouse that day and thought about dropping a hammer on your head. Uh, that's nice. I didn't, though. <laughs> Thanks. Still think he's to blame for this whole situation. What? What the? No, no, no! What the heck? No! We got something up ahead. Gosh dang it, game! Don't freaking do this to me! Oh my god! Roads blocked. Let's walk on the road. Now we gotta deal with this. The train. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. I didn't go anywhere as you've Stay been. close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? Hadn't crossed my mind. Okay, well, I'm going to stop there. Um, I'm not going to be doing these like 50 minute hour long things like I, were, I was doing with the catch up videos. I'm thinking around 30 or so. Obviously that depends on how episodes end and stuff, but you know, just the way it goes. But uh, I'm going to stop there. So thank you so much for watching this return to The Walking Dead with me, John. If you enjoyed, hammer that like button, share with your friends, subscribe if you're new to join the Wolfpack, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.